lovelies and welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by and checking out this video if you're new to this channel i mean if today is your first time discovering this channel oh my god you are welcome i am so happy to have you here and my name's joy and on this channel i'll be bringing you latest news and gist and if you would like to see more videos from this channel do go ahead and click on the red button down below and turn on the bell for notifications so you'll be notified whenever i upload new videos with that being said, let's get into the video. Let's watch together. Um, guys, I'm giving up on Biafra. And before I give up on Biafra, I want to ask this quick few questions. I want to ask our presidency question. I want to have ask Buhari as they claim is at the seat, the reason. I want to ask the House of Assembly, the three arms of government, the lawmakers. I want to ask the ministry, all the ministry involved in ruling Nigerians. I want to ask the governors of the eastern, southern, and south-south governors. Please, if this question is answered, then I believe that Namdi Kano will gladly give up Biafra. I believe that Sunday Bohotu will give up agitating for Oduduwa Republic, but I need these few questions to be answered. Please, I don't want you guys to be angry with me. So, I believe you will take your time to listen to what I'm saying. Number one question is this. Why is it that when they are sick... No, 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 I'm not asking you. Why is it that when you are sick... I'm talking to all the ministry involved. Why is it that when you are sick, you go to abroad for medical treatment? Does that mean you don't believe in yourself? Does that mean you don't believe in the country that you are ruling, that is number one question. When you are sick, you leave your country that you claim that is doing well, that we should not agitate, then you go abroad for medical treatment. Does that mean that you are not doing well? Hello? Number two, why is it that when you make money in your country, then you take that money abroad to go and buy a house? and save money in the foreign account. Does that mean you don't believe in your country? Hello, sirs. Hello, senators. Hello, presidency. Hello, police. Hello, soldiers. Hello, all the ministries. Hello, lecturers. Please, somebody answer these questions. Does that mean you don't believe in your country? When you pick up the money that you steal or you make, then, okay, let's assume you didn't steal the money. The money that you make, you take it abroad to save in the a foreign a foreign account, buy house abroad. Does that mean you don't believe in yourself? How many size houses does Mama Charlie buy? The Queen of England, how many houses does he have in Africa? Boris Johnson, how many houses does he have? Donald Trump, the president, all of them. How many of them have houses in Africa? None. They believe in themselves. Number two. Why is it that your children school abroad? Please answer the question. I'm sorry, I want to give up on Biafra. And I believe Namdi Kanu will give up too. If you answer the question, why is it that your children go to school abroad? If you, that, does that mean you don't believe in yourself? You don't believe in Nigeria? Oh, oh, this is nonsense country. Oh, you check the children abroad to school. Does that, does that mean you're ruling well? Does that make you a good leadership? Does that make you a good president? Does that make you... Come on, guys. You are sick. You run abroad. You cannot equip your own house. Your children also want to school. They go abroad to school. When you have money, you go abroad to keep your money in foreign account. Does that mean you don't believe in yourself, sass? I'm not disrespecting you. I won't make an answer me. Then we all give up. Then I want to ask another question. Is it a rocket science to have electricity since 1960? Is that a rocket science? To answer the question, why is it that we don't have electricity? Even Sudan don't have problem of electricity. Do you know that? Sudan is one of the worst countries where we say they go dash me and I go fish stay. They don't have problem of electricity. Do you know that? Is it a rocket science? 
why is it that is it difficult for you people to fix the elections? And you're asking people not to talk. You're asking people not to agitate for separation. Please, these questions I need to answer. I don't want to take much of your time. I've lived abroad for a while. For a while. Four years down the line, my fridge has not been removed from electricity. I mean my fridge has not been removed in electricity. I have soup that I cooked since last year. Where it remain? I left it there, back in the freezer. I can't, I just leave it there because I don't want to throw it away and I don't need it now. My fan, my air condition has never been removed from electricity for the past four years. Is that a rocket science? That's the question I'm asking. If they answer this question, then we give up on Biafra. I believe everybody watching me now, we give up on Biafra. Then let's talk about the road. Is it a rocket science to fix the road? I beg, those of you that are watching me now, I want you to do something. Please go to my YouTube channel, Solomon Okereke Vlog. Go and type road trip in Israel. There's a video I make there to show people how road is look like abroad. Everywhere, clean. Go and watch that video. That video is over 15 minutes. Go and watch it. Is it a rocket science to fix Nigerian roads? From Abuja to Enugu? All around the country. Is it a rocket science to fix the road? You could answer now. Una presidency, una they enjoy. Oh, don't, yeah, don't take the kill Nandi Kano. Kill Sunday, bo. Pa, pa, pa. Hey, are you a Biafra? Uh, pa, pa, pa. Are you IPOP? Pa, pa, pa. The people that are shooting, they are the ones suffering past. The children of the po common policemen, all those police, street police, they are the most hungry in the world. Yes, them for that in the in, the, in that Nigeria, all those army. Where did they say kill him, kill him, kill him? If you see Biafra, shoot him. They are the most hungry. If this question is answered, I said, if this question is answered, then we all give up on Biafra. But if you cannot answer this question, then shh and give us Biafra and Ududua Republic. I will see you in my next one. And thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think about this video at the comment section. And I will see you in my next one. As always, thanks for watching. But if you have not subscribed to this channel, my God, go ahead and click on that red button down below and turn on the bell for notifications so you will be notified anytime I upload new videos. And do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Oh my God. Ciao, ciao. Bye. I love you all. Mm. Joy. Can you see the vision?